what is going on everybody it is talent i'm bringing you my week eight battle versus yeehaw and the house of mouse now a little bit of a different start right now showing you guys the standings as this is our final week before playoffs as it stands right now we are in eighth place and not really due to our record but more to our differential when i've been losing it i've been losing by a decent amount when i'm winning i'm not winning by a ton so yeah <laughs> so that is gonna make it so if we win we're in if we win we are five and three we make playoffs if we lose we need things to go our way for us to make playoffs so we'll see but i'm trying to get a win this week and i have some real fire this week against yeehaw and jumping right into it yeehaw has a really scary team he is three and four on the season he would need a lot to go right to make playoffs but he's still trying to make there make it there and he has gouging fire which is a giant threat it's super hard to break through he has enamorous which is just uh, super it can be super fast it can be super strong it can be contrary very difficult cinderace for court change as well as just like super like these three are very difficult to get rid of sticky webs here on the rabombi is difficult we have ways of dealing with it but I am very scared about sticky webs because it does kind of throw us off a little bit. Um, thinking about that now, there is maybe one change I'm going to make, um, but we'll see. Uh, Miss Magius, which I don't really expect, but actually does put a decent damper into our team. If it's like specs, it can actually KO a lot of things with like strong shadow balls. Tentacruel is also... Uh, it, it, I don't see it coming, but it kind of just... Yeah, I don't, I don't see Tentacle coming at all. Uh, Chinchino and Glastier, Glast Glastier, excuse me, both two really good Terra Captains. Um, I could see either of them coming, to be honest. Probably more the Chinchino with like a tidy up triple axle knockoff set. But uh, yeah, either way, we have ways of dealing with both of them. Our, Cal our, our Chaladon is... A, a huge pain to get rid of it walls a lot of it a lot of our team we have ways of dealing with it ludicolo if they get the rain up actually is a huge damper into our team and actually had to after doing some mocks i actually had to i didn't expect ludicolo at all and then i faced it i'm like wow this thing actually like does huge work if it's in the rain uh he's not bringing volpix so anyways for this week we are leading off with adamant i'm gonna change this to clear body i'm just letting you know right now because i am scared of the rabambi sticky web even if we have ways of dealing with it i still don't want to deal with it but we are bringing adamant dragon dance dragon darts dragapult this week we have enough speed to outspeed a max speed rabambi which is huge we have dragon darts because it just does huge damage to everything we have phantom force because you may be wondering oh it's a two-turn move why would he ever want to do that well the thing is nothing on this team really wants to take a phantom force and even if he is in on something and then switches into chinchina well we can just click dragon darts or click u-turn and i'm not really worried about that so phantom force is kind of free and i'm going to definitely capitalize on that because he really doesn't have he doesn't have a ghost resist outside of the chinchino which doesn't really want to come in on a dragon pole anyways we threw the rest into attack adamant we're trying to do as much damage as possible click dragon dance click dragon darts and just do huge damage and that leads into our next mon expert belt goaler this week we're running just a simple max hp max attack set just wanted to get the most damage off and live the most hits possible we have earthquake poltergeist dynamic punch stone edge there really wasn't any reason i didn't run one life war because i still wanted to live a lot of hits but poltergeist is huge just for hu just huge damage and everything earthquake hits the gouging fire hits the cinderace stone edge for the enamorous for the rabambi uh we can basically hit everything for super effective i think except for the ludicolo but i i can click poltergeist on that and i'm probably not going to stay in on that anyway so we do huge damage to everything originally i had heavy slam but i think stone edge is a little bit better because it covers um he has a pretty big rock weakness so it covers the cinderace the gouging the enamorous the rabambi his his first four picks are all weak to rock and going into our next mon we have av golurk so av blastoise excuse me i just woke up so <laughs> So Blastoise here, we can live three Moonblasts from a uh, modest Enamorous, 
which is pretty dang cool. We have Rapid Spin to get rid of those sticky webs, those Stealth Rock. We have Mirror Coat to just do huge damage back to either a Bombi or a Miss Magius or a... I think we actually can live two specs, Miss Magius, either Shadow Balls or Thunderbolts, which is which is crazy. Um, live Hitzer to Ludicolo and just fire off some Mirror Coats and just get some huge damage on those. Flip Turn just to get out of there. Not quite yet for priority if they're running like a sash. We just need to get a little bit of chip. We don't have priority on the rest of the team, so this is where we're going to get our priority from if we just need a revenge killer. So no attack investment, but we threw the rest into defense for the gouging for the Cinderace. And yeah, for the Chinchino. And yeah, that's going to be the Blastoise set. And that goes right into our Weezing set, which I, I'm not going to lie. I don't remember what these EVs do. Uh, I think we may live a... Uh, Oh, no, we live a Flash Cannon from um, a uh, Arcaladon. Either no investment plus one, or we live, I think, max... May maybe? I don't know, actually. Um, it may be something with an Amorous. I'm not sure, but either way... Running Rocky Helmet just to... This thing is going to be like a huge answer to the Gouging Fire because it's going to want to click Flare Blitz and we're going to say no. But that's not going to be our biggest answer to the Gouging. Uh, we have Defog to get rid of. Again, those Sticky Webs, which I don't want to deal with. Pain Split Haze because of Anamorous with like Super Power or Gouging with Dragon Dance or even Chinchina with Tidy Up. Uh, as well as the Arcaladon with the uh, Stamina and like Iron Defense Body Press. Or even glass chair. He has a lot of setup options, and I just don't want to deal with it. So we have haze, and we have it instead of clear smog because of the Arcaladon. Uh, I just really don't want to deal with like a huge body press issue. And then we have sludge bomb. It's for general damage. Yes, we can't touch the Arcaladon, the Archaladon, excuse me, but we do really big damage into the uh, Enamorous. We do big damage in the Rabombi, and we do big damage in the Ludicolo, and just like nice damage into everything else actually. 85 special attack is just it's not bad so yeah we threw uh, a ton into special defense the rest into defense and we're basically just gonna this is gonna be one of our best defensive pivots this blastoise uh, are gonna be two of the most important mons in this battle just to pivot in and out and yeah now the next mon is heat i will let you know right now this jirachi set is hit heat we are running Weakness Policy, Wish, Protect, Iron Defense, Stored Power. Now, the plan for this is to click Iron Defense, uh, basically get to plus four, take a hit from the Gouging or from the Cinderace, and then just be clicking over and over the Stored Power. Uh, wish, Protect, just to get the health back. We can live in Enamorous uh, Specs. I think we can live, yeah, a Specs Earth Power from the Enamorous, which is huge. And then, even if they're modest, I think. And then, yeah, we live um, a Gouging Fire uh, Heat Crash, even if they're, like, super invested and adamant. But we're going to, what's most likely going to happen is that we're going to click Iron Defense. They're going on, like, something. If it's, like, probably if the Arcaladon is in and we lose Pokemon, I'm probably going to go into Jirachi. I'm going to click Iron Defense, they're going to have to switch, and they're going to go into Gouging, and we're just going to keep clicking Iron Defense, they're going to get our Weakness Policy off, and then we can sweep, basically, because they do not have a, they do not have a Dark type, unless they have, like, Sucker Punch on the Cinderace, which is possible, but again, I think I could stall out the Sucker Punches, um, with our Wish Protect and Iron Defense, so I'm actually not even worried about that, and... Yeah, this is going to be like our super win con, and I'm excited for it. And our final mon is going to be just Specs Kilowattril. We're Terra Ground for the gouging for the Air Chaladon, and we're just going to be clicking Volt Switch, clicking Thunderbolt. This is going to be probably our lead um, because he doesn't have a ground type. Oops, he doesn't have a ground type, so we can just like spam Volt Switch, and we can we actually have enough HP to live a Specs Enamorous Moonblast, which is huge. Um, if he le or sorry, Scarf Enamorous uh, Moonblast if he does decide to lead with that but we're gonna lead with killo we're gonna click volt switch and we're gonna see where the game goes from there so yeah let's just jump right into the battle see you there welcome to the battle everyone and he brought the vulpix i was not expecting the vulpix i guess that uh it helps out the glass chair a little bit but yeah our lead here is always going to be kilowattril uh let me just send in a good luck have fun you too and yeah 
this is a huge battle for us not sure if he brings the vulpix how seriously he's taking it so i will take it but uh yeah let's leave with our killo he's gonna leave with the gouging which is scary and we are terra on golurk but i think i just kind of want to click terra terra blast ground here i think the most getting huge damage on gouging will be huge and i, I think i just want to do that so if he switches to enamorous I mean, that's crazy in my opinion, but I just want to click Terra Blast Ground and see how much damage we do. As we do 75%, that's huge. He's Citrus, and he gets the Dragon Dance up. That is a little bit concerning here, but he may just go for a Heat Crash or something. I think I just want to go into our Weezing. Um, PC restart. Um, I think I just want to go into our Weezing and see what happens from there. I definitely don't want to lose Kilo. As he goes for the Dragon Claw, huge 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 i think he may just go for the flare blitz here um this is a little bit concerning but do i go for sludge bomb or haze i think i just go for sludge bomb to get as much damage as possible yeah so he goes for iron head that actually doesn't even do half huge please don't flinch huge and i would love a poison that is huge huge damage there as i assume he's gonna go for an iron head again i think i do want to just switch into the blastoise because we can take basically whatever and yeah so we're gonna switch into blastoise here and he goes for earthquake that's fine and we are gonna get gouging fire out of the way early which is huge our chaladon's gonna come in uh, our caladon excuse me i cannot get that right um i assume he's gonna be av i really do want to switch into our jirachi here because i don't think he can do anything to us and yeah i think that is what we're gonna do because i don't want to flip turn and let him get um body press activated so he yeah he just clicks body press there that's fine and i'm just gonna click iron defense uh i don't really know what he does about the jirachi he may go into enamorous which i'm honestly fine with uh i probably will switch out if he goes into enamorous but I, actually you don't go into enamorous here because i could be scarf he goes into tentacruel that's fine uh we're gonna click iron defense and he i don't think would he have haze i'm not sure um we're just gonna click iron defense again he made a clear song chilling water this is fine this is completely fine uh you can click chilling water as much as you want i'm gonna just click wish hydro pump but uh throw off a wish and i'm just gonna get another iron defense off here he keeps missing the hydros that's crazy i'm sorry man um as i do kind of want to get a wish off one more and then click stored power and i think that is what i'm gonna do yeah so he connects on the hydro we're gonna throw off a wish and then we're just gonna click stored power he, he he he's connecting on the hydros which is good and stored power does about half is he black sludge he is not um i'm just gonna click stored power again actually yeah and oh wow okay it was a roll so mirror coat wow okay that did a lot of damage um so how much has hydro been doing hydro has been doing it could do up to 26 i don't think i want to risk it i think i just want to click oh my god i should have clicked wish there i forgot oh my goodness okay well we get another we get the ko with jirachi but uh that was scary um he brings in the volpix which unless he's max doesn't outspeed us he may just go for um what's it called aurora veil and i think if he goes for aurora veil it's kind of a throw so i'm gonna throw off a wish he goes for ice shard oh my god that didn't do enough that is crazy that is that is crazy oh my god i'm gonna click protect here um that is crazy he's probably gonna click aurora veil he does uh, i'm gonna get another wish off he goes for encore good play good play um I mean, I can switch, and I think actually switching into Weezing will be good for me. So, yeah, I'm just going to switch into Weezing and get all my health back. And he goes Baton Pass. He's probably going to go into Archaladon. Um, but this is fine, honestly. I get my health back. Just playing a huge pivot game. I really need Differential here. How much did Body Press do? I, I need as much Differential as possible. Uh, Body Press did 19, so yeah, I think I can freely switch into the Jirachi here. He's going to go for Flash Cannon. That's fine. I'm going to go for Wish. He's going to go for Electro Shot. Oh, wait. Oh, Power Orb. That's going to kill us. Okay. That is good to know, as he is 
the light clay. Okay. So we live and we learn. Um, hmm. Okay, so he is power herb, so he's not AV. Flash cannon may kill the kilowatt roll. Um, interesting. What do I want to do here? Do I want to go on the Blastoise? He may click Draco. And actually, I think I'm okay with that. So I'm going to just go on the Blastoise and click Mirror Coat. I think he's going to click like a Draco. He clicks Electroshock shot. Um, I get the Wish back. But yeah, I'm just going to go on a Killo here. Because yeah, there's no reason for me not to. Um, interesting, interesting. I need to play this game very, very smart. I do not want to lose Killo here, so I'm going to Volt, and yeah, it's going to do nothing, but I'm going to go into, god, this is like really concerning, um, I'm going to go into the Blastoise, if he goes for Electroshot, I just switch in the Killo, he goes for Flash Cannon, this is fine, um, I don't think he has anything to damage me, so, I wonder how much to an Archaladon, or Caladon, I really, it's not AV, um, we do with our Killo. Retair ground. We can kill. Oh, we actually, we do kill if he's, even if he's like max, max, we kill, which is awesome. So I think we have a slow flip turn. I'm going to flip turn. He clicks body press the crit. That kind of sucks. Um, but we're going to do this and uh, do we go into goal lurk? I don't know if we outspeed a goal lurk, so I just want to go into our Killo. And he may just go into Enamorous, but I think that's a throw if I do throw off an electric move or, like, just click Volt Switch. So, uh, yeah, I don't think you ever go Enamorous. I think it kind of proves that his Enamorous, like, isn't Scarf. As he actually goes into Enamorous. That's crazy. That is crazy. Um, okay, um, do I want to go into Weezing or do I want to go into the Blastoise here? Enamorous, if you're Scarf, uh, Weezing... A Earth Power does nothing because we are levitated, of course. What about Psychic? Psychic. Uh, Psychic's going to do huge damage, but I think I need to risk it because anything else... Yeah. I don't think you're physical. Uh, if you do go for Super Power, good play. But Oh, you do go for Super Power. So you could be um, Iron Head. And yeah, there's no reason here why I'm not gonna click Sludge Bomb. You click Zen Head, but please don't flinch. 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 Oh, uh, that's really bad. That's really bad. Well, it's fine. We're gonna lose the Weezing um, because I, I can't switch into something else here. It's just it's not worth it. So we're gonna lose the Weezing, which sucks. But um, yeah, we learned that it isn't Scarf at least. So we just go into Killo and we click Volt Switch. Um, yeah, you go into our, Ch our Caledon. That's fine. Big Volt Switch. As I think I want to go into Golurk. I wonder how much Golurk does to a plus one our Chaladon. Um, I mean, if you're no defense, it most likely kills. I think I kind of have to do it. Um, could go for the dynamic punch, but I think I just want to go for as much stab damage as possible. So I'm just going to go for the earthquake flash cannon 37 and yeah, that's looking like it definitely has some investment. Um, he may think we're banded and go into the enamorous. And I think I do want to risk and go for poltergeist poltergeist will definitely kill I believe even if he's like max max which i don't think he is yeah so we're gonna go for poltergeist hoping he goes into enamorous he doesn't but oh my god he used this item oh that's so bad for me okay oh we're gonna lose our golurk i can't believe i did that i am tired <laughs> and i i blundered that play for sure that is all on me i forgot that he used his power herb i really wanted to be focused this week and have just not been so i still think we can win this um he goes into the vulpix 
as we are just going to click Volt Switch, do crazy damage. That's insane. Um, I don't want him to get the Aurora Veil off again, so we're just going to go into Blastoise and click Aqua Jet because I really cannot have this thing get off another um, Aurora Veil, and that's exactly what happens. No Aurora Veil. He goes into Enamorous, and I mean, he has physical. I mean, I kind of... I mean, he's gonna click superpower here i kind of just want to flip turn play rough doesn't kill huge and we click the flip turn and we are just gonna go into our killo which has been huge for us this game so far and yeah we're just gonna click the volt switch nice and i think here we can go into dragapult um because i feel pretty i feel pretty good i'm fine losing dragapult I need the differential, but I think I'm okay losing Dragapult. Uh, let's see how it does against the Glass Drear. It could still be a Terra, but a... Uh, yeah, if you're Max... I mean, I think you always just click Icicle Crash here. I'm just going to click Dragon da Dragon Darts. One. Oh my god, you were bulky. You were bulky. Oh my god, that did nothing. Why did that do not? Are you just max? Oh my god, that did absolutely nothing. It did 32%. That That is like max, max. Okay, so how much does Killo do? Killo with Thunderbolt. Oh my god, okay. So actually what we have to do, we're only going to win this game 1-0. We are going to win, which is fine. Actually, yeah, we're, we're fine. Because Volt Switch... Because you were max max, you're not. You could be AV. I don't think you're AV. We'll see. I know I have to click Volt Switch here though, because I cannot lose Killo. I have to click Volt Switch. We learn if you're AV. If you're AV, we may lose this game. Definitely a, a chance. Protect. You're not AV. Okay, I think we win. I think we win. Um, we go for the Volt Switch. Uh, even if you click Trailblaze, we're fine. Volt Switch does thirty percent. That's crazy. Why did it do 30%? I mean, you can't... How did it do 30%? I'm so confused. What is this set? Goes for Crunch. And I just have to click Thunderbolt. But... How did it do 30%? I know we killed the Archaladon. How did he do 30%? We killed the glass here. Oh my god, thank god. Kill a watch roll is so goaded. Kill a watch roll is so goaded. We're gonna get the 1-0 victory, and we are gonna be 5 and 3. Oh my god. So will we come out 5 and 3? We are gonna have a plus one differential, even though we are 5 and 3, but we are gonna make playoffs. So that is huge thanks on the back of kilowattrol and a little bit of, of the jirachi but oh my goodness i even with the gold lurk blunder i we got the win so i'm so happy about that so i have no idea what class year set that was that it was taking everything i've never been so confused in my life but uh yeah but let's go we're gonna be in playoffs and yeah that means i'm gonna have to see you guys next week so stay tuned peace